Hey everyone, it's Barb. We're back in the vegan kitchen. And guess what's for dinner? Oh yeah, we've got these wonderful portobello Asian mushroom burgers. This recipe was inspired by one of my favorite all-time chefs. His name is Gaz Oakley. You're going to get to meet him in a second here on the video. I saw this recipe and I thought, wow, that looks really good. The combination of the ingredients and how you treat the mushrooms was very inspiring to me. And as I said, it's a chef created recipe, not hard to do, but definitely wonderful. So I want you to meet Gaz Oakley. Isn't he adorable? He hails from Wales in the United Kingdom and I really needed to meet him, and I say meet in quotations. I had been vegan for about six months, and I really needed to up my recipe game a little bit. And I came across Gaz, and I started to cook some of his recipes. And he, he was just starting out on YouTube. Maybe he had 10,000 people. Uh, now he has more than a million. He has three cookbooks and he really helped to show me how to elevate my cooking skills. Not just vegan cooking skills, but cooking skills in general. He's a huge proponent of really spicing things up in a very special way. And he really taught me about how to use spices and how to look at food from a very gourmet perspective, even vegan food, and I took a lot of inspiration from him. So check him out. Now here's the burger when it's all done and assembled. I am not going to show you so much about how I cooked it, but I definitely want to show you what goes in it so you can maybe be inspired to make these yourself. The recipe link to Gaz's site I'll put below so that you can, if you're interested in creating this burger, you can go ahead and do it. I wholly, highly recommend it because it is delicious. Hey everybody, it's Barb. We're having burgers for dinner tonight and I want to show you how to put them together. I will put the recipe in the comments below. This is a recipe from one of my favorite vegan chefs. His name is Gaz Oakley, and he is out of the United Kingdom. And these are Asian burgers. And what you do is you take a mushroom. This is a portobello mushroom that is dredged in a, a batter made out of flour and water and oil. Then it's dipped in panko crumbs and flour and all kinds of spices. And then it's um, very gently fried on both sides. It could be, if you wanted it to be, um, baked in the oven. But here's how he assembles it, and this is the best part of it. So this is a little sriracha mayonnaise on one side here. Then I'm going to crumble some vegan cheese on here that I made the other day. This is made out of cashews and... Uh, water, spices, nutritional yeast, um, it has uh, coconut oil in it, and basically uh, a f it, there's agar agar in it, which is like a seaweed that makes a gel and creates a thickening for it. Then you put the burger on top, give it a little smush there so that it stays down in place. Then I like a little bit of more sriracha mayonnaise, just a tiny bit, because this is a little bit dry. Then what we have is, let me get a spoon, another spoon here. This is a, an Asian sauce that the recipe includes, and this is to make it, give it that really authentic Asian flavor. A little bit of that on there. Then I think we're going to do the spinach next. Now it called for lettuce, but in this household we just don't care. <laughs> if it's lettuce, it's lettuce or spinach. It's, it's all the same to us. Get a nice few leaves on there. And one of the more interesting ingredients da, 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 is kimchi. And you put a little kimchi on here. Sorry, the fingers. Fingers are the best tools in the kitchen. A little bit of kimchi. And and make that look pretty. And then I think uh, maybe a little bit more sriracha. And that is how this burger goes together. And the way Gaz does it is he gives it a little smush so you can see 
how yummy it is. And there it is, the Asian burger with kimchi. And it's a mushroom burger. And that's one burger down, and I have three more to go. But thanks for tuning in tonight and, and watching me put these burgers together. If you want to watch me do another one, I'll just do it kind of silently. A little sriracha. A little bit of cheese. This is Steve's burger. It's a nice big one, nice big patty. And then a few leaves. Oops, we forgot the this sauce here it goes in on top of this. This has green onions in it, brown sugar, some more spinach leaves. bit more sriracha, some more kimchi, and it's leaking out all over. Steve, what do you think of that for dinner? That's going to be good. Looks great. I know, huh? All right, everyone. Thanks for tuning in, and uh, I'll be back at you shortly with more great food from the Pink Radish Vegan Kitchen. Take care. Thank you for watching. I hope you try these burgers. When Steve took the first bite, he went, oh, yum. Take care, and I'll be back with another video very soon.